A major shakeup tonight in Newport News politics. The city manager is out. Jim Borey resigned today following a lengthy closed door meeting. It comes less than a week after stepping down from the Peninsula Airport Commission, a group under fire for their spending of taxpayer money. Ted on your side, Joe Fisher has been following this since the beginning. Joe. Well, Anita, it's that drama at the Newport News Williamsburg Airport that Councilwoman Sharon Scott says has led to a public outcry over transparency. A state audit into the airport's finances, she says, has given the city a bad name, a city that tonight has new leadership. Today is a day of victory for the citizens of Newport News. Rejoicing outside City Hall is the president of the Peninsula chapter of the SCLC, who've been calling for City Manager Jim Borey to resign since shortly after he arrived in 2013. When you're in a position of trust for the citizens, you got to do the will of the people. You got to answer to the citizens. What we do know is Tuesday, the council unanimously accepted Borey's resignation after reviewing his job performance for two and a half hours. Obviously, I'm disappointed that uh, it's coming to an end at this point in time, but I think uh, we're ready to move on. What we don't know is what topics the council discussed behind closed doors and if they asked Bory to step aside. We're going to start moving on. Perhaps, you know, someone else may have some new ideas that could really benefit us. Bory called his nearly four years on the job productive, but critics say he's failed at handling the city's big issues. We have a major crime wave and in gang wars and we're wasting money on stuff like marathons. The resignation comes just days after Bory resigned from the airport commission. The state accuses the airport of unauthorized spending when they used three and a half million dollars to pay off a bank loan that should have only been used for capital improvement projects. Bory was on the commission in 2014 when the check was signed. Councilwoman Sharon Scott hopes Bory's departure will bring about new trust in city government. We do work for the citizens, so the citizens are concerned with some of the things that has been going on. And and so has council been. And the city council unanimously appointed assistant city manager Cynthia Rolf as acting city manager. Meanwhile, Bory's severance package includes six months pay. That comes out to about $112,000. And over the next six months, he'll earn $625 each month for his car allowance. We're live in Newport News tonight. I'm Joe Fisher, 10 on your side.